Hey guys and welcome back to PVC Spartan. I I told you guys in a previous video that I was working on a battle axe and I showed you the first part of a build where I was sanding down a piece of a piece of PVC. Well, I was having some camera difficulties and I didn't want to bother with it. So I went on and uh, finished making the PVC battle axe. And I'm going to give you guys a walkthrough on it. So, what's going on here is, this is the final product, the final axe blade of the that I made from the PVC. And I was going to have like a, like a hammer end or a spike, but the way I did it, it looked too cartoony. It, it didn't look right. So I just botched that and uh, went with the nice axe just a regular it looks like a hatchet blade almost but uh that's what i like and that's what i did and what i did to conceal some of the some of the some of the cuttings like you know when you have to make a slit in the wood to stick in your in your uh blade for an axe i went i went along and put some uh copper some flat pieces of copper and I bent it to where there's a flat piece here there's a bend right here you guys, if you guys can see that and then it just keeps going well what I did for that was I got that piece of copper like I said drilled it drilled it on top and then got a little ball ping hammer and just started pounding it down until it got a nice clean contour of the of the axe handle and that's what I did, and it looks pretty nice. And I went on a, and I uh, once I was done with that, I uh, sprayed it gold, sprayed all the bolts. I got some screws in there. If you can see, I sprayed everything gold, except for what you're gonna see in a minute. And uh, I also made a little clamp right here to conceal the front piece, so you didn't see any. PVC leftover and or any of the cuts I made so that's that part and what I'm showing you now is the actual grip and for the grip I did some blue leather that's two pieces of scrap blue leather I had lying around and when I did that I just tied I got a couple wood grips wood um, clamps and I clamped one side. I tightened it as good as I could, and then I drilled for for uh, for screws in there. And when, once I was done with that, I I grabbed the other side of the piece, tightened it. Sorry about that. Tightened it as much as I could, and then drilled in for more pieces, for more screws. And I did that with the other piece right here. And then I wasn't quite happy with how how the leather looked by itself. It didn't. It just looked like one piece of leather overlaying the other, and I didn't really like that. So what I did was I got some paracord, some thin paracord rope or thread, whatever you want to call it, and I laid it all around where the leather ends. And I just got some super glue, put, dripped it all around where the leather end ends, and I uh, wrapped the rope around. And I'm pretty happy about that. I thought it was going to be really hard. The only thing I would have liked to done is uh, color, not colored, sprayed it, sprayed this rope gold, because that's what I wanted to go for. I wanted to make it look like it was either a king's or a, a nice warrior's battle axe and uh... that's what that's what i wanted to look for and that's what i pretty much got except for this this uh, rope but hey nobody's perfect sometimes you gotta just compromise so yeah this is what i this is what i made maybe 
maybe I can use it. I'm probably not. Basically, this is just a showpiece. And this is just to show your friends, hey, look what I made. Check it out. It looks pretty awesome. I mean, you can take it to Comic-Con. I doubt they're going to let you use it in a LARPing, a LARPing uh, gathering. So I wouldn't take it there. I'd just hang it up or make it look really nice somewhere in your room. So that's all I have for you guys today. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. And uh, I have a Facebook page if you guys want to make an even better battle axe. Go ahead. I'd love to see what you guys come up with. So when you do that, leave, post it on my Facebook page, PVC Spartan. And I'd love to see what you guys come up with. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.